A clip taken from the latest YouTuber event Misfits Boxing 3 shows some of the worst technique and form you will ever see in a ring. YouTube boxing and celebrity boxing has taken over the headlines of the age-old sport, with YouTubers such as, Aness and Gibb and. Of course, the Paul brothers earning far more publicity and money in the ring than most professional fighters do. It was reported by Forbes earlier this year that YouTube boxing's most famous figure earned an incredible $40 million in the ring in 2021. And while Jake Paul may be slowly gaining more respect from boxing fans fight by fight, as his opponents increase in their reputable fighting status, some YouTube fights still leave much to be desired when it comes to quality. Saturday night's bout between inexperienced MMA fighter-slash-vlogger Josh Bruckner and former college football player-slash-reality TV star Chase. Demur is a good example of where YouTube boxing once again makes a mockery of the sport. A clip posted. On Twitter by at Nadim El Haddad 1 shows in just 4 seconds how poor the quality of YouTuber boxing can be. Bruckner throws. A right hand that seems to lose all power a third into the punch and is responded to by an overthrown right hand by Demur that unbalances himself and sends him stumbling back as if it was himself who had been punched. The short clip is astounding to many boxing fans at just how poor the athlete's form in the ring is. One comment stated, I don't think I've ever felt my heart laugh so hard, while another commented, this can't be real. Y'all just let anybody box now, huh? Me trying to throw punches in my dreams. This is what boxing has come to, you're literally taking the pee out of every British boxing fan and getting paid while doing it, WTF is that? Do people actually pay to watch that? And how do you expect serious boxing fans to subscribe to this s? Seriously were a few more responses too. Ouch. Watching the clip makes one question how much boxing training the supposed experienced athletes even did before lacing the gloves for the Misfits boxing event. The card also saw former fighter Greg Hardy drop Jake Paul's planned former opponent Hazem Rahman Jr. and King Kenny knockout TikTok star DK Money. The Bruckner v. Demur fight ultimately ended in Demur. Most famously known for appearing on Too Hot to Handle, quitting the bout after just two rounds when the heavyweight did not get up off his stool for the third round. According to the DAZN commentator, the reality TV star had stated that he was seeing three of his opponent Bruckner and that was the reason behind him quitting the bout early. Not a good look for YouTuber boxing which continues to dumbfound many traditional boxing fans by the audiences and revenues it generates. While the quality continues to leave much to be desired considering the size of event.